Hello, Mikey Tate here with Inspired Technical Services. People like to write stories of their own on Microsoft Office Word 2007. They also like to make great looking presentations with PowerPoint 2007 as well. But the catch is that someone could steal your work and make it as their own. And that's when things can get pretty ugly. But that's not the case though. It won't be a problem until after I talk to you about headers and footers and how you can set them up in Microsoft Office PowerPoint and Word 2007. Headers and footers are important when writing stories or other documents in Word 2007 because anybody that reads your text will see that you wrote the document, avoiding any confusion and other incidents. Now let's talk about what headers and footers are. Headers go on top of your document. It is made for the purpose of telling readers what the title of your document is, who wrote it, and when it was made. If you want, you don't have to enter the date. In fact, you can delete stuff from the header you don't want or need. Just simply right click on the item, then click remove content control. But if you want to edit the header while it is inactive, just double click it. Doing so while it is active will also deactivate it so you can work on other parts of the document without messing up the header. The footer belongs at the bottom of the document. It tells the reader the page he or she is currently reading, although you can pretty much add anything you want. It can be a chapter title, contact info, or whatever that comes to mind. Now that we have learned about the header and footer, let's begin adding them to Word. Here is an empty document. We are about to create a story out of it. And we are going to start it off with the header and footer. So let's go to the insert tab by clicking here. Here we have all the stuff we can add to our document. But we are mostly going to focus on the header and footer section. Because remember that we are adding a header and footer. Now by clicking on either one, it'll bring up the following. This displays a list of header or footer designs. The footer the footer's design can match with the header's design as well. Looking down below though, you can see two buttons. Edit header or footer and delete header or footer. Click here to remove the header or footer from your document, but you can add it again at any time by choosing one of the designs here as discussed a moment ago. You can make changes to the header and footer by clicking here. It'll then bring up the header and footer menu here along with the design tab here.